I, I wanted um, a broad spectrum that I could use for everything. So I started thinking and I started looking and I bumped into this uh, ingredient called the lagic acid, which you find uh, in a lot of plants, specifically in raspberry seeds. So I'm, I'm researching elagic acid and it starts to, I'm, I'm finding for bacteria, it will affect the uh, enzyme gyrase, which is what lets bacteria DNA to coil. So it causes the bacterial DNA to unspool, which <laughs> means that the bacteria doesn't do very well. Then I found for viruses, it would interfere with the integrase enzyme, which is one of the enzymes that uh, viruses use to penetrate the cell wall so they can get replicated. And then I found out it would suppress chitin synthase, uh, which is the enzyme uh, fungi use to build their cell wall. And I thought, wow, this is amazing stuff. I want to take this every day. And then I found out that it was an uh, apoptotic inducer. And what that means is um, cells, when they get old or damaged, um, they're supposed to commit, uh, they're supposed to self-destruct. Uh, it's a safeguard against cancer because cells that get damaged and don't self-destruct become, can become growths. And the body, this process where a cell self-destructs is called apoptosis or apoesis, depending on where you went to medical school. Uh, Elagic acid has been shown to support apoptosis. And I mixed in some plant matter, some herbs, that had some research behind them that they would uh, uh, support uh, healthy blood viscosity. And I put that in with the elagic acid and put them in as a capsule, and uh, it's really great stuff. Okay, so there's different risks at different decades of life. For instance, um, right. you know, car crashes in your 20s, heart attacks in the 50s, cancer in 60s, uh, lung and kidneys in the 80s and 90s, Alzheimer's. Um, and I think that uh, giving the body some support in its apoptosis system once we hit 50, I think is, um, is wise. I'll, I'll phrase it that way.